demonstrate. Hopefully this will start on its own in a minute. I'm assuming it's not started at the moment because it's on a loading screen. Oh, there we go. Right, so hello to anybody in the chat. I was planning on streaming a bit later today, but I'm still quite tired early in the evening, so I want to do this and then have a nap for a bit. So I bought this DLC Friday when it came out, only finished it today just because of the fact that, um, you know, I've been quite sort of ill the last few days. So I didn't manage to play much, you know, because I was getting migraines looking at the screen and things like that. So, um, Dad? yeah, I completed this earlier and quite enjoyed it. Um, Dad? Are you so there? the first bit's kind of just more of a stealthy sort of tutorial bit, I guess, for the people who haven't played the actual base game. Hopefully comments turn up in a moment, because it says nine people are watching, but um, I can't see any comments yet, so... I will say hello to people if they turn up in the chat in a moment. So again, with this DLC, the critics <gasps> gave it bad reviews, but the, um... What is this place? It's yeah, I've got a 3090. A why game like this doesn't really need a 3090, but yeah. You know why? Dad, it doesn't matter. Oh, come on. It right, Joshua. Be, of course it matters. Besides, you're the one always saying that you're old enough to scavenge. Well, today, you actually are. But we're not even supposed to be here. The Resistance said Skynet was around here. I wouldn't take everything John Connor says as gospel. What do you have against him? asshole. We went to school together. This school, actually. You've met John Connor? I didn't know him personally, but everybody knew about him. I <laughs> guess this was just one of the schools he got expelled from. It. Doubt he'd remember it. Okay, it looks safe. You can follow me. So at the beginning bit, it's like a flashback You're nightmare bit where he just plays a little kid. You? I don't need you to babysit me, Dad. Get yourself over here. If you want to read the notes, just pause it when um, I sort of open them up because I won't keep them up on the screen. Hope everybody's alright. Like I said, I'm definitely starting to feel quite a bit better now. Hey, but Dad, yeah, that um, found some chemicals. sort of booster I had really sort of made me feel ill for quite today. a few days. I'm still taking them. Start searching this place. What are we even looking for? A time capsule. What's a time capsule? Well, it's a, a box filled with letters, pictures, and other things that we buried when I was a student here. Why did you bury it? To preserve so obviously, most of the game's an action game. It's just this bit at the beginning. Is, um, like I was saying, just sort of a tutorially sort of um, more stealthy bit. Here lies history. I think I found it. Yeah, when some more people come into the chat, I can obviously chat a bit more with people. But at the moment, it says there's only five people on about two different people comment. Since that won't be possible for you, I'd like you to have at least a taste of what I had. Okay, let's see what we've got. Uh, or something? Really? A machine? Yeah. We've got enough of those around here, don't we? <laughs> Okay, what else is in there? Some baseball cards, cassette tape. Dad, I, I think we should go. I really don't need anything. How about this? I know it's not much. Happy birthday, Jim. I assume the sound's coming through all right. Is it both my That's voice cool. and the audio from the game? Thanks, Dad. Oh, look at this. That's a letter I wrote to myself. What does it say? Future Frank. That's me. If you don't teach your son to mind his own business, I'm going to be very disappointed with you. Uh -huh. very I just double-checked the chat in case oh, it's on. broken where I'm viewing Fine. it. Fine. Let's just go. It's not safe here. Wait, there's something else here. This one says that it needs to be hand-delivered. 
see what's so important. Dad, we don't have time for this. It's not for you. I doubt anyone's waiting for you. How would you like it if a stranger read your letter? Are you serious? I'm just trying to follow your rules. <sighs> you know what? It's your birthday. I won't open it unless we find the proper recipient. It'll be our little project. I promise. <gasps> Come here. Uh, okay, like the actual proper game starts now. As soon as it comes closer, we make a run for it, right? Now go. Come on, Jacob. Stay close. I'm right behind you. I'm actually in front of him, but whatever. Through here. Just go. Yes, nobody else is joining the chat then. Watch out! Gonna need to concentrate a minute, but I'll read what Justin said. Oh, that's good, Justin. So you actually got to Sora Consultant despite all the shit going on at the moment. That's good. Am I right, Tyre? I guess it's just late sending a notification out to most people. This is a lot harder when I did this on hard the first time I played this because their um, like you know stealth detecting things are better. Let's make a run for it. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Oh, have they spotted me? Yeah, right, run, run. I'll probably die here, but um, I might be able to outrun. Jacob, are you okay? Dad. Don't sound too good. Don't worry about me. Get out of here. Understand? But Dad. I said get out of here. Get down into the sewers. I'll meet you there soon. Um. Dad? Oh, legally there's nothing wrong with firing paper out your air rifle, but if the paper's not heavy enough, it can work as a dry fire. So you need paper that at least weighs the same amount as an air rifle pellet. Does that make sense? Because you can get, like, paper cleaning pellet things, which you fire through an air rifle to clean them out. But again, um, you need to make sure it's heavy enough that it doesn't act as a dry fire. When I first played this, I got killed here a couple of times.
I think it's probably worse of a springer or like a gas ramp if you did it with paper. I doubt a PCP would actually have an issue, but um. Uh, yeah, Springer air rifles have a spring, because that's how they compress the gas. I'm safe. Do you hear me? If it's a brake barrel, it's a spring or a gas him, ram, please. you need the paper to be as heavy as a pellet or it will damage you? it, yes, because of the recoil. Acts as a dry fire. You're, you're hurt. They're coming. We need to go. We're gonna be alright. Come on. Alright, Rich. Move back! Dad! Jacob, run! <laughs> So what happens here is basically the most of this DLC is set in between, like, part way through this game, like the base game, before the end of the base game. H hard to say, you'd need to weigh him properly. Sleeping on the job, I see. If you what? want to do it properly, I'd say, say buy proper happened. cleaning pellets, don't make your own. But again, it's one of those oh, things where you just yeah. have to experiment. I knew I'd find them here. Are you okay? You were talking in your sleep. Just a bad dream. Baron's looking for you. We've got visitors that she wants you to meet. Visitors? A tech comm unit. At least what's left of it. Just a heads up. Something's going on. Everyone's walking around nervous. Thanks. Again, there's a note over there by the look of it, so I'll just open it for a couple of seconds and then close it, so if anybody wants to read it, they can pause the video. All right, I'll just get that storyline from you again. Right, so close that now. If you want to read it, watch the thing back or pause it. I appreciate you taking us in, Commander. I was sorry to hear about your team. Fucking ambush. I'll write it in the report. That can wait. New orders have come in for you. Excuse me? You're moving out right away. We just lost three men. Me and Pharaoh need some time to recuperate. I'm afraid that's not possible. Northridge Outpost has gone silent. You need to go there, find out what happened, and... What? Check if their radio's on? You know that Skynet's been jamming our signal. That may be true, but you'll still need to see to this personally. What the hell is going on here? Look, it doesn't make sense to me either. I could have sent a team of my own. They'd already be there and we would know what went wrong. So? Why didn't you? Because the order's coming directly from John Connor. He insisted it be you. Okay. So what's the plan? Go to Northridge, find out what happened. Then escort the people there back to safety. Their withdrawal is long overdue. Where it is that you captured a new Terminator model? That's right. An infiltration unit. Our top scientist is running an analysis on it as we speak. Does that have anything to do with this mission? The last we heard from Northridge was that they liberated a group of scavengers. So that's certainly a possibility. I see. Jacob Rivers here helped us capture the new model. He'll be joining you along with Evans, as per Connor's request. Okay, Rivers. So you can tell an infiltrator from one of us. What else can you do? Right, I'm going to spec my points differently than when I first played this, because it's probably going to be easier to put as much on fast learner as possible. Um... Definitely do the weapons ones you can do at the beginning. And I'll probably want hacking at least a two and crafting to one. 
because I found with this you don't need lock picking very much in this DLC, so it's kind of a waste of points to use the um, lock picking ones up, or at least you know, not so you're a marksman. too much. Good. We need sharp eyes out there. All right. Check the supply crate and gather your equipment. Looks like we're moving out soon. Get ready. We got a long drive ahead of us. Right, I probably actually will use a proper gun on this one. Yeah, how much is an M4? An M16? 600, oh, not too bad. Right, I'll use the scope rifle just because it's a lot more accurate. Okay, that'll do for now. I just want guns because obviously with the like drone type robots, you don't actually need um, Open the, gate. We're moving out. the proper things for them. Got some strange comments just now. I have no idea what um question question mark X question mark. Approaching Northridge. All right, it's a good time to bring everyone up to speed. This is a rescue mission, as simple as it gets. We go in, secure the perimeter. Uh, a lot better today, thanks, Reptile. I'm still getting a bit tired quite early, but I've had a lot more energy than the last couple of days. We keep our heads down and evacuate those people to safety. What if there's no one to evacuate? Care to elaborate, Corporal? Outposts don't stay silent for that long. If no one's been reporting in, I'd expect to find the remains of a massacre, sir. I think introductions are in order. The eternal optimist sitting next to me is Corporal Farrow, an explosive specialist. Yeah, I'm hoping in a couple of days, Reptile, I feel Sergeant completely back Rivers to normal, because I feel much better today than I did the last couple what of days. What about you, Evans? What's your story? I've read your file. You're the sole survivor from the 113th, right? 113th? heard about it. How'd you manage to escape? Supposedly he took down a T-800 with his bare hands. That's impossible. That's what I'm saying. Is it true? Did John Connor select us for this assignment? That's right. I'd like to meet him. Complete the mission and you just might. Getting close. Get ready. Right, Fluzzy. Yeah, I said to him about you know you can get the proper cleaning pellets, which are properly weighed and like pre-oiled. So I was saying that's the only thing I'd really recommend shooting through it, other than a real pellet. And even with real pellets, there's some that are much lower quality than others. Evans, give us the sip. No signs of any resistance. I did see you uploaded a visit uh, video the other day, Fluzzy. So I'll check that out at some point. I haven't had time yet. T six hundred. They're still around. Let's not get sloppy. Yeah, Justin, my mum was quite lucky to get an appointment the um, other week, you know, she's been given antibiotics and all that, so like I said, if some of my symptoms don't clear up in a couple of days, I'll try and get an emergency appointment, but as I feel a lot better today, I'm thinking I've sort of overcome everything. Everyone on me! Target acquired. Target down. I was saying the good thing is at least today I feel a lot better than I did the last few days. Um, but yeah, um, 
once I do this stream, I'll only stream for about an hour. I'll have a nap for a bit, and then if weapon collectors, I'll wake up to watch him before I go to bed. Um, yeah, like and some of the days at the moment, I've only had like five hours of being awake. That makes sense. You know, I work the morning, completely exhausted by the afternoon. Sort of go to bed, get up for maybe an hour, and then go back to bed again. So I'm definitely a lot more energetic than that. So I've been up all day so far. can if you want to make a suggestion, as long as it's sensible. Uh, you're probably typing, Alex, something that YouTube doesn't like. Because YouTube has a massive list now of words you can't say. Or phrases you can't say. Let's move. We need to get to the basement. That's where they'd have taken their stand. If anyone's left alive, they'll be there. Yeah, when I'm in a combat bit, obviously I'll jump between the chat and actually shooting at the enemy so I can read what's going on without being killed. Let's move! Downstairs! Evans, you stay there and watch for reinforcements. Understood. This way! Alright, everyone get ready. Two in front! Um, I've played the Saboteur before, if you mean the Pandemic one, before Pandemic got closed down by EA. I've played it. The one where you play as like the French Resistance guy, that one. I've played that, if that's the game you're about. What the fuck is going on, Sergeant? Where is everyone? Clear the area first. Figure it out later. Enemies coming from the left. Looking on your side. That's all of them. Then secure the perimeter. Well, we can see the comment where you said your comments are being deleted. Yeah, it's a shame pandemic got like ruined by EA. What do we do now? We need to report this. Find a radio station and keep your eyes open. Yes, sir. No bodies? This doesn't make any sense. Nothing. 
I'm just going to check all the locations because I found the radio thing first time when I did this um, last time, so I might as well check the other locations first and see what's there. No radio station. So yeah, it's always in the same place. Huh? Better now at the moment, Dan, thanks. As I said, I'm not still completely back to normal, but I felt way better today than I have done, like, last, you know, almost week, I'd say. Because it was only a couple of days after I had my booster that my, you know, I felt really fluey and bad. So, um, at least today, you know, I'm nowhere near as tired as I was, um, last, you know, week. I wasn't too bad last Monday, but I suppose that's because the vaccine hadn't worked in my system yet. So it was when, obviously, I started having immuno reactions to it. Oh, I'll grab that. So it was what the note said. Yeah. Oh, real plasma gun this early on. Yeah, that is good. Yeah, I didn't spot that last time. Right. So yeah, not completely back to normal, but a lot better than I have been. I've been having a lot less coughing and like phlegm today and everything else. Can't. Sergeant. Is there actually the a PC release of the Saboteur? Because I'm sure I must have played it on PS3 or whatever it was out on, like 360 and PS3 when it first came out. Did they do a PC release? I understand you're not happy with the situation, but for now you'll have to stay put. At least until I discuss your next move with Connor. Is that clear? Yes, Commander. We're waiting for other instructions. Over and out. Alright. Looks like we're turning in for the night. I understand that not everything went as planned today. There's still a lot of unanswered questions here. But for now, get some rest. Tomorrow will be when the real work starts. Yes, sir. Oh, that's good to know it's on GOG, so that will play all right on the modern PC. Rivers, if you have a moment, I need to talk to you about your performance today. Sir. You're very efficient, reliable. That's good. That'll keep the other members of the team motivated. Oh, he gave me a telling off last time. While, so I, appreciate your contribution I don't know if that's just like the amount of NPCs you killed during this first bit. Keep it up. That's probably just because yes, I'm sir. playing on medium, not hard this time, so you, you just do more damage with all your ammo. Oh, that sounds good then. I might pick up the PC version then. Yeah, Alex, no idea why, it's just you're obviously saying something YouTube doesn't like, and we've all worked out on here from loads of other streams that there's lots of words that shouldn't be banned by YouTube that are just banned, as in, you know, words that just have very common, regular uses that aren't, you know, racist, sexist, anything like that, not even insults, that YouTube just hides for some reason now. Sarge, any new orders from HQ? Not yet. For now, we're on our own. I have Pharaoh searching for any intel we may have missed yesterday. We'll see what comes up. What do we know so far, sir? I've been analyzing the intel that we have. We got some theories, but nothing concrete. I'm curious to hear what you think happened here. Where do you think those people went? Maybe those T600s took the people here by surprise, put them on transporters. And what we fought yesterday was just a patrol left to make sure they got it. I agree. Your presence here doesn't fit this puzzle. But ultimately, the T-600 is a discontinued series. If Skynet wanted to abduct everyone without a trace, why send an outdated model? It's not impossible that an old Skynet army just wandered in here before everyone had left. As you can see, there's a lot to unpack here. And questions keep piling up. Yeah, that was one of them, At this point, we just have to keep our eyes open. Speaking of which, do you mind checking on Pharaoh? I'm waiting for a status report from him. Yes, sir. It wasn't on Twitter, but there was another platform like Twitter, I remember. There was like a load of words for no reason or banned, but you know, very similar other words weren't. So you had to just keep using alternative words for things. Even though, you know, like none of them were offensive words, which was, again, it's like that same sort of thing. So like, say with safety, um, Rich, if like safety was blocked, protection would be allowed, it was like one of those sort of things. 
Um, but at least on Twitter, I think it actually told you, or whichever platform it was, that, you know, like, your comment has been deleted because it contains a, ba a blocked word. They wouldn't tell you what the word was, but at least, you know, it would tell you they deleted your comment. As opposed to, um, you know, your comments just vanished. I'm going to buy pistol ammo because I will have a good use for that in a bit. I'll just talk to all the NPCs and then I can start doing all the side objectives. God damn it! Yeah, it's probably because it did it as asshole, didn't it? I'm trying to get but inside the armory. Rather than just a hole as in, I dug a hole. I'd love to do it. There is a hole over there. Yeah. Reese doesn't want us to make too much noise. Can you help me? Yeah, this is what will happen. Um, just in moment with the internet after a while. use the termination knives, or terminator knives, whatever they're called, termination knives, a lot more in this DLC than I did the base game, even though it's shorter. I think there's a lot more places in this you can actually stealth the levels. You mentioned a bet. What do you mean? Evans has a theory that people here packed and left. I didn't think much of it at first. But an empty armory certainly is a head-scratcher. I guess we've got to keep looking. Speaking of which, I'm supposed to do a sweep of the entire area. Yeah, I if think it's general, it's not even worth thinking games. after a while why it's they block certain things, just because you go things. mad if you try and like work you out every reason why a certain thing is blocked. Sure, I'll let him know. What do you think about this whole situation? I think it's obvious something fucked up happened here. I'm just mad at myself that I didn't see this coming. Oh yeah, as in a hole well, to put a dick in. Whenever yes. Reese gets a direct order from Connor, something's off. I just thought it might have thought it was short for arsehole, but yeah. Um, I've not played the new Battlefield, because I've seen that's got really bad reviews at the moment, but some of the older Battlefields I like. What's Reese like? you worked with him for a long time. You want to know what Kyle Reese is like? He's like stone or steel. Nothing ever gets to him. For better or worse. What do you mean? This is the first time we've been able to take a minute to ourselves since the failure of our last mission, you know? And he's been up all day trying to figure out our next move. He's able to just disconnect, work himself tirelessly, as if nothing happened. Even if a lot of shit happened. I'm sure it's because he cares for his people. I'd say that he cares for the mission more than his people. Here I am, trying to hold it together, thinking about the people we lost. And not doing a good job of it. Well, you wanted to know about Reese, not me. That's what he's like. Rivers, report to the communications room when you have a minute. I've got two skill points. Alright, might as well put at least one into lockpicking. Then I'll do another into crafting, because there will certainly be points soon where I can manufacture ammo earlier by having crafting. Oh, I suppose that's meant to be consent, actually, but no, I just, it looked like it said consent. I've been for a year, haven't I? Craft, let's say, seven lockpicks because you don't need very many. Then I'll craft, craft 350 of the plasma cells. Yeah, having crafting at the beginning really helps with this to just make use of the resources rather than getting rid of them. Right, where's Evans? I can't remember. Something like that. 
Oh, right in the middle. <laughs> That's what I couldn't see him because I kept thinking he was in the building. Yeah. Right, Hero done. mentioned there's a back room nearby that needs checking. Can you help me? She said it's a two-man job. Just let me know when. How did you know we wouldn't find anything in that armor? I've been trying to work on the car, but the garage here is missing some tools. The only things still lying around here are what the protocol deems inessential equipment. The things that are supposed to be left behind during an evacuation. Those people were packed and ready to go. Do you think it's safe to stay here? That group of T-600s that we destroyed yesterday is a discontinued infiltration unit. They tend to malfunction. I doubt they're still connected to Skynet, so they couldn't give out our location. We're safe here. Having said that, I don't like the direction of Rachel Pitts. North? Yeah. I'm ready. Let's go and see what's in that room. Yeah, it's, um... <laughs> So it, it's like you get semi-open world so, maps on these, but yeah, it, it's more just yeah, based car. obviously on the Terminator. But you took down a Terminator with your bare hands. It's true. How'd you do that? I didn't even know someone could do that. I was angry. Now focus. We have a job to do. This is it. How do you want to do this? Oh. Check what's inside. I'm heading back. So yeah, you've got the fallout lock picking mechanic. Is this room? Sarge. I've got a hold of some intel regarding someone who used to live just outside the shelter. Permission to follow the lead. Permission granted. Well, remember, we as I've said before, um... So I need you to move on to the Copy thing is that. with like this removing the dislike is it doesn't really work because you can tell when a video has loads and loads of views with barely any likes it's probably got loads of dislikes. But they've probably done it because of the reason that things like the White House channel gets loads of dislikes. You know, so like lots of official channels uh, get dislikes, so, you know, they complain to YouTube and then YouTube remove the dislike, I would imagine, something like that. Right, Stug, did you see my message on Discord I sent you earlier? I've not, not looked at Discord since I sent you that, but, um, I did send you a message on there earlier about the Mark 6 a Oh, that's all shoot. Rivers! We don't need Skynet's eyes on us right now. Yeah, I'm trying to clear out some space. I've decided just to start selling a lot of stuff I didn't want to sell before. So I'll check Discord in a bit anyway. But, um... Uh, probably about sixty pounds the riot visor, so it's obviously the Kevlar one, not the older Mark VI. But most, when I looked on YouTube, they tend to be between forty and a hundred pounds, depending on what accessories they come with. I'll check the size for you and everything as well. Um, but yeah, uh, probably about sixty pounds, and then the postage. That way, it's still like a decent price for it. But it's not silly because, like I said at the moment, I saw a load on eBay that were um, when I was checking the price. Oh, my backpack is full. What can I drop to pick up these, which I don't really need? Uh, I'll do the cloth is at least. Alright, Snoz. But yeah, cool, I'll, I'll send you some pictures of it, like, tomorrow or whatever, because, um... Yeah, like I said uh, to people earlier, because I'm still recovering from, like, that post-viral fatigue, sort of feeling a bit ill. Well, I've had a lot more energy today and felt a lot better. I'm still getting quite tired. So what I want to do is, because I think Mike's on Twitch later, is sort of finish this stream, have a nap for a couple of hours, then go on Twitch till, like, midnight, then go, you know, um, to bed after that properly. But yeah, I've got it handy so I can um, take some pictures of it pretty early tomorrow.
Uh, vaguely fuzzy, yeah. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, I mean, as I've not got Ruger 22, I've not got much use for it. But yeah, that's actually pretty cool. So yeah. This doesn't make any sense. Resistance soldiers came to evacuate them. Need to report this to police. Actually, is there anything in here? I didn't check that off. Right? And I've got a skill point, so I might as well just use that to increase my backpack size at the moment. So I can just pick up all the items that are in here. Oh, that, that rat was worth seven resources. <laughs> Rather than, like, one or whatever the normal ones are worth. These ones are easier to disarm from this side. Yeah. Now if you've got a Ruger 1022, you might as well if it's not too much. But yeah, it's just like saying for me there's not much point because I'm trying to get rid of stuff that's taking up space rather than adding more, although I'm quite bad at that, because there'll be something when I'll because last week on eBay I did spend quite a bit of money just because there were some items like I've been after for a while, never seen for sale, and then like a couple of sellers had them in. Um, I'll talk in a member stream a bit more what they are. They're like perfectly, you know, like legal fine items, but I'll go on more of a stream and I can talk about them a bit more in detail. But you know, stuff where I've been looking for some stuff for like a year or two and then um, the sellers got them in. I did see since I bought one of the items they've already sold like 10 of the 15 they got in as a surplus shop. You know, within like a day, so I am glad I bought it, because I was umming and ahhing and then thought, fuck it, I'll buy it, and yeah, they're nearly sold out within like a day or two of being listed now. So obviously a lot of people have noticed they're on there and are buying them. Yeah, um, where are you looking for S10s? Because obviously you will find S10s on eBay, but for decent prices, army surplus shops, weirdly, are now actually better than eBay a lot of the time for S10s. Right, so what we'll do is, in a minute, we'll start the next mission. Um, once the next mission starts, um, we'll play the first bit of that, and then um, we can, um, I'll go, sort Sergeant, of, you know, finish the stream off. Someone used an emergency broadcast system to deliver a message. One of ours? Judging by how inaccurate the message is, it's more likely sent by a civilian. One of our missing residents? That's what we'll need to figure out. It's our best lead so far. I found something. A note from someone who witnessed Northridge being evacuated. By what appeared to be resistance soldiers. Alright, Mike. Right. That's what I was afraid of. You missed the bit at the beginning with the sphincter, um, now that we're sort of sphincter shrinking bit, sphincter clenching bit. Um, that's a bit like the hospital bit no. from the first um, game. Where, um, but you're a little kid and there's oh, T600s after you and it's even harder. about that message that concerns me. It's been sent from somewhere inside Bakersfield. Isn't that just on the edge of the annihilation? That's right. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm working seven days a week at the moment, Dan. Start. The first day I have prop off properly now is Christmas Day. Unless, you know, like, we get told at work that we can't go in because of Omicron or something like that. So, yeah, I'm still working a lot, but like I said, I'm at least starting to feel better now because of the fact that, like I said, once you're ill and you're working a lot, that's when it really kind of starts wearing you down. Because I don't like taking sick days unless I'm really sick. I might actually just sell them to make a nice for now. I did actually use them quite a bit in this gameplay. But, um... Before I finish this mission, I'm going to see if I can craft any more stuff for the workbench just to free up space. It was down here somewhere, wasn't it, the workbench? Uh, okay, Mike. Yeah, that's all right with me, because what I was saying to some people before you came on is I was planning on having a nap once I finished this stream. Um, so I might just have an early night, and that actually suits me better, because it's easier for me to go to bed early, you know, and then have, um, say, a ten-hour sleep, than, um, you know, do a few hours, wake up for a couple of hours, and then do an eight-hour sleep. Um, yeah, it should be pretty close to the beginning of the stream, Mike. 
but I finished this DLC the other day because it came out Friday. I wanted to play it all Friday, but then because I was ill, I didn't sort of get around to playing much of it, and I finished it off this afternoon. But I really like this DLC. It's very much, you know, if you like Terminator 1, you'll like this, because obviously it's got Kyle Reese in and a couple of the other people from Terminator 1, and some more music that's remixed from Terminator 1, and some, you know, other stuff from the Terminator lore, like the T600s. Yeah, so the good thing was, Mike, at least I am feeling a lot better today. Because I think some of it was, you know, where you have a reaction to the vaccine, even if it's, like, not a dangerous reaction. It makes you feel fluey for a few days, so... Um, at the moment, I've been finding the best thing to feel good the next day is actually just getting quite an early night. Because sometimes I do wake up in the night recently, you know, if I'm coughing up phlegm. But that's going away. If you didn't see if I said, Mike, my mum actually has to have antibiotics now for that same cough she had. Um, because, um, yeah, she went to the doctors because it wasn't clearing up and she actually had some sort of chest infection. So they gave her some antibiotics and some other sort of tablets to take for it to clear it up. But again, like, she hadn't been to the doctors because of the fact that, you know, she couldn't get an appointment. So she was just doing the thing of hoping it cleared up on its own and it didn't go away. But mine seems to be going now, so I'm just going to give it another week and then if it's not gone, I'll get an emergency appointment and say, you know, my mum was diagnosed with something, so um, can you check me out as well? If you can hear a noise in the background that isn't in the game, it's probably the computer fan, I imagine. But obviously there's ambient noise in the game and whatever else, and you're going to pick up other noises on the... Um... I think I mentioned it in today's video. But yeah, she was saying the bad thing is when she finally got to see the doctors, Received they said, oh, you should have come in, you know, much earlier. She's like, well, I couldn't get an appointment. Because, you know, that's the problem at the moment, the isn't it? Outpost. That, so if it gets like, the doctors, and again, it's not really the doctor's fault if they're massively right. overwhelmed you know with people they couldn't see during lockdown and now all, like, coming in to see them. Feral. But, Shotgun. Shotgun? Yeah. I only brought my rifle. Oh. Okay, forget it. The Terminator's come on to talk about a Terminator game, you're right, T-800? Or whatever model of Terminator you are. Right, so I'll do a bit of this mission before I go off. I'm a bit more awake now I've started playing or something, but like I said, I am going to get an early night tonight, just because, again, up early tomorrow, early-ish, got some stuff to this do. This is it. The message was sent from somewhere around here. It wasn't accurate enough to give us the exact location. So to cover more ground, we'll be splitting into two groups. I'll be spotting for Rivers. Evans, you spot for Fair. What exactly are we looking for, sir? Any signs of civilian activity. No one's been in the area for a long time, so report anything you see. Understood? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Rules of engagement, sir. Fire at will. Let's move out. Rivers, let's go. Where did we start? There used to be a non-military checkpoint at an old command center in this area. That's where I want you to go first. I only worked out today, Mike, when I was playing this, that all the resistance people basically just have bomber jackets with extra padding on them. Like, you know, like tire track looking padding. Which I know it's like the things they have from the first film, you still. We could let them pass. It's your call. Let's kill them. Nice and easy. Building over there is a good vantage point. I'll be able to navigate you from there. Are you sure you're ready to do this on your own? Yes, sir. All right then. Just keep your radio close. Yeah, if, is he? If I can get to a position where, um, yeah, if I have to talk to me, if you look, or it's not the right thing there, but yeah, you can tell from the pockets it's basically a bomber jacket. But I noticed when it was like a bit where you know I was talking to somebody in a conversation, you could see it properly. Good luck, Rivers. Oh, that was HK. Okay, so I guess I want to do the western north one HK first. Flying by. We don't have enough firepower to destroy it, so keep an eye on it. If it searchlight spots you, you're out of luck. I'm at the top. I got a good view from here. I can see that the HK could be a problem. 
I can't make much at the moment, so I won't bother. I think it's this mission where you get the pistol from Terminator 1, which is really good. I was using it all the way through this when I was playing it on hard. Although it's not good against Terminators, it is good against like the drones. Because it does like three or four times as much damage as the regular pistol in Uzi. bit too many of them really to do that, wasn't there? Oh, well. At least I'm not playing on hard this time. I died a lot playing this DLC on hard, but it's much harder than the base game. I've got enough ammo this time because I've leveled my crafting up. Ah, those are the ones that don't have any arms. Ah, oh, that's good. I guess they can't shoot back at me. There's still some over there. Oh, I suppose I could put some chips in my gun as well if I've got enough to do it. With. Even on normal, it's like a bit dangerous in this game. That's that lot down at least. Yeah, I don't think the Terminators always glow when it's on the hip, but yeah, you can at least, it does show everything in real time, so it does work like a real scope. So yeah, that that is good, because in a lot of games, scopes are just like a flat texture, aren't they? But I was playing about that earlier, like, you know, seeing the fire glows, actually. But, um... Uh, if, if you were saying you like my videos, thanks, Daniel. Right, anyway, let me try and upgrade these if I've got enough chips. Damage, do I have anything else that's... Do I have anything else that's square, square? No, okay, um... I still need square, square, wouldn't it, so... Square something else on the left. Clip, yeah, and then do I have any one that's a two square? Nah, I have to wait a bit, I think, to actually level the guns up. Just because at the moment there's not really enough chips that I've picked up to actually be able to make a good combination. That's the thing, even on normal they're still quite dangerous in this. Um, I'll let the HK go by before I go back out. I don't think this is a stream about football, Steve, if that's what you're on about. Yeah, fair enough, Lassie. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I, I'm, I was a bit confused by that. Um, the only thing I know about football is there was a game called off today because of coronavirus. That's literally the only thing I know about football at the moment. Rivers, I've noticed something. There's a Skynet antenna not far from your position. I think that HK is part of it. That's why it keeps popping up. Anything we can do about it? It's too dangerous. These types of facilities usually have their generators deep underground. First, you need a way to get down there. So yeah, I want to watch that paper armor one. I've just not got around to it yet, because I think I I'll see the notification as work. But technically speaking, yeah, you need a room. rather than that pistol. Good 
say, once I get the good pistol, it's really powerful. Um, the Terminator 1 pistol. But, um, I think it's on one of the side objectives up here, so we'll see if I can get that while the stream's on. It's definitely one of those things you want for later in the game, because having a like single slot weapon that, you know, takes really cheap ammo but does an absurd amount of damage is brilliant for taking out like this little sort of spider box without wasting plasma rounds. Not see me now. Something's seen me apparently. Getting closer to that checkpoint. I'm gonna do this bit first. Building's compromised. Clear. Uh, I'd like to proceed forward, sir. We need I'm to be out. sure. Out of med kits. Yes. Right, I'm gonna, because I know what's gonna happen, I'm going to put, replace the pistol with those laser bombs for the time being. Oh, I didn't remember that one being there. Is it coming down here yet? Let's see if I can just headshot him. Yeah, there we go. It's quite a good thing There's no one here. Rifle. Take a look around. See if you can find something useful. Shotgun, yes please. At least early on. I know this isn't the place I'm actually thinking of. Um, uh, I found a note about their evacuation plan. It points to a location nearby. It's worth checking out. Maybe it's this one. Ah, oh, yeah, it's probably, I think, this one it tells you to go to now. Yeah, generally we don't often talk about the football on here. Sometimes we talk about football, but it has to be normally when England's playing for me to actually bother. You know, like England, Scotland, Wales, sort of thing. Or I find it very interesting. That's a flamethrower at least. Quite easy to take now. I get a good photo. I'll do this other objective that's right next to me for the time being. Oh, this is the first time because I've put, didn't put the lock pick up on this one. I've actually needed it. Um, so like I said, it, this DLC doesn't really need a lock picking thing. Hacking is a lot more useful in it because it's nearly all Skynet stuff in this DLC rather than ruins. Um, there is obviously meant to be something in this place I'm meant to look at, unless it is the back room, which I need the lock picking thing to do. I just have another check in case it just triggers something for a moment. Hey, I think that's the staircase, isn't it, in there to get to the upper floor. So I'll level up lock picking to the next level when I need to. I think it's probably like that witness one I'm meant to technically do next in terms of order of difficulty uh, up on the north side of the map. Run 
for the time being and come back. So we've um I don't have any spare skill points. Uh, yeah, Flazzy, if you're asking about how old this DLC is, this DLC came out on Friday. But the game, I think, was 2019, if I remember right. Because I think the game came out December 2019, uh, or like November 2019. Then in November or December 2020, they did a free DLC where you play as a Terminator and like have to kill Resistance members. It's like, you know, like an hour-long DLC. And this is like a paid-for story one. It's not very expensive, it was less than 10 quid, and it's like four or five hours long. See how good the sniper rifle is going to be. Yeah, quite a lot better. Yeah, there he is. Oh, still did quite a lot of damage in you know, some sort of weak spine of things. Right, plungers, coaches. I did a video earlier sort of saying what's going on with me at the moment. But yeah, the, the good news is at the moment I've been feeling a lot better sort of today than yesterday. And yesterday I felt better than, you know, the day before. So I'm hoping, you know, within the next few days I'll feel back to normal. So I'd like to feel quite healthy for Christmas. Oh, shit. Um, HK spotted me. Because I, I don't want to be ill for Christmas, because it's like, like last fucking Christmas when I had mumps, although worse symptoms are gone by Christmas Day. It's still one of those things where, you know, you don't want to feel ill with it at Christmas time. Let's, let's do that the objective then. Yeah, that's the thing, isn't it, Mike, where with COVID and all the other bugs going around, you really don't want to do have something before Christmas that makes you ill for Christmas. Fuck! What was that? I fell into a basement. Shit! That's the way. Stay calm. Try taking this one by one. I suppose so, but they're they're quite different, aren't they, in like terms of the plot and everything. But I suppose the computers That's are bad guys in both, but proceeding with the mission. Matrix is more like a kung fu y kind of philosophical thing. Terminator's more about robots that go Found around killing room. people directly. So you're really gonna go through with this. Word of warning. Get yourself some sound decoys. The perimeter around the antenna is littered with silverfish. 
I see a junkyard close by. If you need some scrap metal to craft sound decoys, that's where you'll find it. Right, good. So I'm not going to even bother crafting sound decoys because I find them pretty useless. Like, I know they do work, but at the same time you can just shoot the silverfish quite easily when they come out of the hole. T-600s have to rev up their attacks. I don't like those. Uh, I'm dead. Where am I? Oh, that was very close. Um, if I get time on Christmas Day, I'd like to do a Christmas stream, because sometimes I get a bit of spare time during the day, but other times it might be, you know, move furniture before relatives get here, because we're hoping this year we can have some more relatives over than last year. So yeah, if I get a free hour during the middle of the day, I probably will do a stream, but obviously the problem is sometimes that like, you end up having to do stuff. Uh, there aren't skinwalkers in this game, it's Terminator. There's nothing to do with skinwalkers. I'm in the command center. Good. Take a look around and see if you can find it. Yeah, we're hoping this year we see some more of our relatives, because last year we had the sort of thing where quite a few of our relatives sort of had been exposed to somebody who had corona or had tested positive for corona. So, you know, to not risk anybody, they all stayed, you know, where they lived. Um, but this year, you know, hopefully most of them are not going to get it, you know, because they've had vaccines and whatever else by Christmas time. Right, I'm going to plant these here when I go up now, just because I know what's coming. So... Because I've played so this far. before, I know the future, so I'll um, put those there. I definitely remember somebody that used to be called Toasty on YouTube, but the problem is because people change their names so often. I can see them know. touching down at what looks like a refueling station. You can try sabotage them if you're up for it. I'm sure Pharaoh and Everett would appreciate it. Just another encoded message. Evans. How's it looking on your end? We just noticed some movement. Someone or something was heading your way. We lost sight of it close to the cemetery. Cemetery. I see it. Rivers. I'm marking it on your map. It's close. Heading there now. Watch out. Hostiles approaching the building. See, that's why I put the um, explosive tripwires on the stairs. Uh, yeah, I've got my Oculus Rift, but I've not used it for ages. It's because it's one of those things that's cool, but there's not that many practical uses for it. At some point, I'll have to get the motion controllers for it, because there are a couple of cool games that use the controllers, but... VR is still one of those things that's really cool, but if you said to me, is it worth it in terms of, like... Well, it's a lot cheaper now, but, you know, like, the enjoyment you get compared to the cost out of it. That's where I'd be a lot more like, uh, maybe... Shit. You know, not necessarily. I can't see him without running. Oh fuck, <laughs> I broke my legs. Right, hopefully the explosives are still on the stairs because of um
Watch out. Hostiles approaching the building. Right, are they still on the stairs? No, that's annoying. So yeah, despawn them. Hopefully I've still got the same amount, but... What's bone works? Is that like a game that's gory or something where you smash people's bones up? Maybe, it, it depends. Because I imagine streaming with VR would be really difficult actually. Because you'd need a very good chat overlay into the game, wouldn't you, if you're using a VR headset? weaker when they get to the explosives, so they hopefully... There's still one coming up with it. Ah, oh, shit, did the explosive not go off that I planted there? Or did the, um, change the action to another one? Kill me this time, man. Oh, no. Good. Where is he? Coming back down the stairs. Oh, the railing stopped it. There we go. Definitely want to get to a save point again now because of obviously losing loads of health and ammo and all that doing this bit. Might as well take one of those if I've got space for it. I could probably drop it in a bit, but that's alright. Maybe it is that the survival one down there I need to do, but I need to get enough skill points first to do the lock picking. So I could do taken off air at the moment probably all grounded. It'd be easiest if I had the guns from the other thing. I'll use the same book here. Let's see if I have at least um things to do the upgrade. So two free. I want something with a three on the left. And I want a three and a two. Yeah that work. That gives it a bit more damage. Uh, I don't think in our lifetimes, but if you ever mean will people make AI that will do bad things, then I definitely think that will happen. But I don't know if it will necessarily like launch nukes that kill everybody and then make a robot army. Mm -hmm. I know there's already been problems where, you know, like companies have made AI and it starts talking to itself in like language that people can't understand. And they've had to shut it down. So if, if stuff like that happens, I'm sure it can do, you know, some evil AI kind of Skynet stuff. Oh no, it's the HK scene. Yes, right, run for it. I'm stuck on a rock. Oh, I'm dead. I won't play too much more tonight, because as I said, I'm quite tired, so, um... But I'll probably stream all of this if people want me to, because it's only like a four to five hour DLC, so I could probably do it across the course of, you know, two week streams. I have to sort my chips out again now. 
Uh, I might as well drop one of these so I don't need two of those plasma rifles. Um, tell you what, I'm, I'm just going to put the damage things actually in the. Um, so, three, two. I'll just do it in this one to get the massive damage boost so I can use it just for like sniping things and saving ammo. I'll just save again now so I don't have to put the chips back in. Yeah, hopefully, Mike, I can do it across, like, the course of four odd streams, because, like I said, this is a four or five hour DLC, depending on, like, how many times you die or if you do all the side quests. Um, HK's coming back in. I don't suppose I've got any um, grenades left, no. spider there. see if I can at least do another side objective type thing or whatever before I um, finish the stream off. You've got that HK refueling station in front of you. Roger that. Right. This might be quite difficult to do with the equipment I've got, but we'll see if I can do it because the HK is like the most annoying thing on this level. So if you can take them out earlier on, it obviously makes the rest of the mission quite a bit easier. At least I do have the sniper rifle to use on the um, Terminators. Though. about if the HKs are coming back because you can hear them flying around. That's at least one of these down. So that gives me some protection from the Terminators. The yeah, exit one's coming right now. At least if some more come to investigate, they'll get shot at by the turret. Is that one coming over or is he just patrolling? Probably 
just has a patrol route down there. Uh, it's a plasma rifle with probably in more than the 40 watt range. But you know, it's normally a phased plasma rifle in the 40 watt range. You get the Uzi 9mm in this as well. Yeah, sorry, power, just what you see. Dick Miller. Autoloader. Um, the pet, the pistol with laser siding or sighting, whatever he says, is in this. It's just what, the one I'm trying to get on this stream, but I might not end up getting it on this stream now. Because it's the one I think I need the higher lock picking level. I'll, I'll definitely make sure I get it while I'm streaming this game. It's the same if I run out of time on tonight's stream, I might not get to it. But, like I said, if, if I'm not staying up for mic streaming. I won't necessarily have to worry about finishing this one as early as I was going to. Oh, there comes another one. Are there any up here? No. Thank you, Fuzzy. 45 long slide with laser sight. Does he say laser sighting, though? No, but yeah. Oh, I've not hacked that yet. But yes, that is a gun in this game, and it is very good. I like it very much, but I am trying to find it, because it is in a side objective place. That's one way of doing it. Uh, hopefully I won't get blown up if I sit here. That's the last one. Great Good. job. That'll slow him down. Now I've got my skill point. I can get the lock pick. Um, lock picking two. And now we can go into that house where I think the, you know, long slide. Yeah, uh, um, I've probably told Mike about it, but you know, there's um, a really bad porno based on the Terminator called The Penetrator with. Um, Ron Jeremy in, but Ron Jeremy isn't actually the penetrator. The penetrator is played by a guy that's meant to look like Arnold. But in the um, gun shop scene, you know, like in the porn shop or the gun shop, whatever it's meant to be, it's like a sex shop and he's going like 12 inch dildo, you know, with lubrication and all that. Hello. It, yeah, what, what actually happened with that? Because the actual Xbox release is available, isn't it, for the normal one, but they weren't doing this on the Xbox or something? It's like saying, because I'm on PC, I've not had this issue, but it's like on PS5, isn't it, this DLC, but not the Xbox or some shit. was the objective? I want to go to that one to the south, don't I? But not taken off there, I want to do the one. So I want to go west and then the south. So I think that's what a pistol is. Yeah, I think if if I had the choice of Sarah Connor, I definitely prefer um, Michael Bean to um, Ron Jeremy. But yeah, if you've got a question, ask the question rather than just saying I've got a question. Although it, YouTube's been deleting a lot of people's comments tonight, as in not me, but YouTube. So if you post a comment, I don't see it. That's not my fault. I'm not too blame. It's on YouTube.
looks like, so I'm going to go directly south, don't I? Although this is the slightly annoying bit to go directly south, because it's the bit where, yeah, that broken house is in the way, so... To go south, I technically need to not fall through the basement, don't I? Or I need to go the long way around, however you do that. Can I just, um... Yeah, there we go. So I can just do that, yeah. I think what happens to the HKs, if I remember right, is they'll fly about round for like a couple of routes and then they can't refuel so they just don't do anything. Because um, it doesn't immediately take them off air blowing up that base, but I think it's if they shoot at you they have to go get more rockets from that base and they can't do that now. There's a locked door there, medium, and there's a locked door. I thought in that one, wasn't there? This is a place mentioned in the... Oh, I, this is just a place I didn't know, walk into. I was looking in the wrong place then, wasn't I? I was looking there, rather than no. here. Yeah. See, Could have just done it straight away. Oh, well. Right, this is the bit I was trying to do earlier. I'm pretty sure this is where you got the long slide. Sergeant, I hear a child's voice coming from inside the building. Child, here. Keep your eyes open. Um, I can't remember, Richard, after watch the clip, because funnily enough, I've not actually watched the full film. Um, because it's like one of those ones where the the plot is like the Terminator but worse. The special effects are going to be the Terminator but worse. Where are you? So unless you wanted to watch just some dodgy porn. Um, Can you hear me? Shit! Yeah, I, I know your games, Terminators. Rivers, get out of there! I'm trying to. Done. Yeah. <laughs> it's actually an older T600 model because it's got the rubber face. But yeah. 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 So yeah, Flavor, you are correct. There's a bit like that in Stalker Call of Pripyat where you hear a baby crying and then it turns out to be a mutant imitating a baby to like lure people into a trap. There we go. So it's called in this the AMT Hardballer. Right, I definitely need to make some room for it. Can I craft some pistol ammo? Because if so... Yeah, there we go. And I might as well craft 11 lockpicks to use space up. Actually, no, no, cancel. Craft 7 plasma spells. Yes. And then craft 4 lockpicks. Okay. And then... Here we go. Right, I'm definitely equipping this. So yeah, let's compare the stats. So, although both of them are meant to be 45 ACP, this one does 135 damage and has a 20 round mag, compared to this one that has 30 damage and a 9 round mag. So, you know, this one is superior in every way. And yeah, that's not a scope, it's just a giant old laser sight on it. So yeah, I, I'm quite pleased this is in there. So now I just need to find some stuff that aren't actual Terminators to kill using this. But this was actually a very good um, gun. A gun when you play through the game in terms of how much damage it does. I see you're in one piece. You stupid. You should have known something. That's how the machines operate. They use our humanity against us. Don't beat yourself up, son. It just means you're still here. Right, yeah, because this is where I thought this thing was, I was looking in the wrong building. Right, I will go off fairly soon now, just because I found this pistol, but I'll just see if I can find something to shoot before going to a save point. 
Yeah, that's actually fairly impressive for like an 80s laser, because have you seen how big some of the old laser units were for like making such a low power laser? It's quite interesting watching those like History Channel where we now have these like little diode lasers the size of, you know, a flashlight. They used to have things that like a hundredth or a thousandth for the power, you know, in like a maglite sized thing, didn't they? Which is kind of crazy, but I suppose it's just how technology evolves. I definitely want a med kit. What can I drop? I'll just drop one piece of scrap metal to get the med kit. Ah, right, um... oh, here we go. Right. Try some more robots for me to shoot. Any more silverfish? Apparently there's one behind that bench somewhere. I can't see it yet. Oh look, it's like the children's playground from Terminator 2. With like the rocking horse thing. Yeah, he never asked the question, or if he did ask a question, it I see blocked it. it. He was probably saying, do they have asbestos in, and the answer is yes. The second generation plasma rifle. Strong enough to bring down an HK? That's exactly right. Annoyingly, um, these aren't strong enough to um, bring down... This is, but the pistol isn't strong enough to bring down Terminators, unfortunately. Uh, skills, should we just do weapons four so I do even more damage with all my base weapons? If you're saying, is it safe to wear them, not if they have a filter on, or if it's got a filter on, hold your breath when you put it on. looking at the chat and didn't see that silverfish coming, but I'm not on heart anymore. Cool. Because you're typing in, as I've said already, something YouTube doesn't like, which doesn't actually mean it's a, um, like, bad thing, because YouTube censors so many comments now, it's impossible to sometimes have a conversation on the live stream. How do I get inside? Right, rather than blowing the antenna up this time, I want to see if I can... Keep your eyes open. Uh, actually hack the turrets on the outside, because then, in theory, they might shoot the HKs down. So I'll do that, and then that'll be a good place to stop once I've done this, um, sort of dungeon sort of type area. Not doing this particular frogger very well, am I? There we go. There we go. Right. Oh shit. I think there are actually still banned words for mods, Flazzy, but yeah, it's far less strict than mods. But um, before Mike was coming on, I was saying, I can't remember if it was Twitter or Twitch or somewhere, 
because it's um, Richard mentioned the a hole thing I again. I, but I was having a conversation now. with somebody on another platform and it kept deleting a thing, but at least on there it told you it deleted your comment because of like an offensive word. So we both had to figure out what the word was and then just use, you know, another substitute and it was a perfectly harmless word, but it was just one where the platform kept banning like a completely routine word. But at least on there it doesn't shadow ban the comment. That's why I don't like the YouTube thing, because on YouTube it literally shows the comment to you like you've made it, but hides it for everybody else. So you think people are just ignoring you when they're not, it's the fact YouTube's hidden your comment. But again, that's like the kind of sneaky censorship, isn't it, doing it that way? Rather than just outright saying we banned you, it's to pretend you're not banned. No idea, Litter Picker, but the um, glorious chairman has decided, um, or whatever, that it needs to be a banned word. So now it's a banned word. Like I said, it, it's not on my block list for obvious reasons. Because it's not like I talk about it a lot in videos regarding old gas masks or whatever. Oh shit. Shit, shit, shit. Oh, at least, at least on medium and hard regular it pauses the game when you're doing this. Because if you play this on the extreme difficulty, um, when, when you're hacking turrets and things like that, unlock picking, the game doesn't pause, so it's very easy to get killed while, um... I've got no healing items, brilliant. So hack will destroy the antenna's it's main core, right? If I hack it, will it actually shoot down the things? Or will it just blow up manually from hacking it? Doesn't matter, but I'd quite like to shoot down the HK using this if it hacks it. Oh no, it's just going to blow up anyway. What was the question? Uh, is, am I able to wear a British gas mask that he has had asbestos removed? If it's been removed properly, you know, to the extent there's none there, then that would be fine. But obviously, if somebody's done a shitty job of it, that's probably even more dangerous than an intact asbestos filter. Because if somebody's literally just pulled a chunk of asbestos out and then taped the filter back up, there's going to be loads of loose fibres in there. Where at least when asbestos so is solid, it's not really a problem. Reporting back. The generator's offline. Move back, Rivers. The antenna's gonna blow. I get those turrets are actually lying, so Holy maybe they will shoot down some HKs. That flash of light was you? Are we trying to destroy Skynet? I thought this was just a rescue mission. Apparently not for Rivers. Evans, we've got to step it up. I appreciate keeping the morale in Rivers. <laughs> Right, actually, I am just going to complete this level now, because um, I'm about ten minutes from the end of it, because I've only got one more objective to do, and it's that close, so why not? Nothing you could do with back pistol. So, um... Drop the standard terminated gun because I really don't need it now. Actually, I'll drop the pistol because I don't need the crap pistol and I've got the um, Terminator 1 pistol. The 
still want to show you what this does to like regular drones, this little um, gun. But you might have to wait till the next stream to see that. If I show you on a plasma container, pretty efficient. But yeah, to give you some idea of the power of it, uh, <laughs> sort of how broken it is, in a sense. Um, the plasma rifle does 65 damage a shot. It does 135 damage this pistol. Although the pistol won't hurt terminators, but still, it means anything that will take damage from a pistol in this. Um, it's more powerful than most plasma weapons in the game, which is retarded, but it's actually really fun. It actually means that you use the pistol late into the game, rather than saying I'll just completely use plasma weapons then. Is that its real name, or is it just like a 1911 variant? I've never actually looked this particular version of um, the 1911 up. Like, I mean, obviously I know it's got like a weird old laser sight on it and all that, but... I know in some of these games they have to give the guns different names, don't they? Because of the fact, like, weird copyright stuff. Um, but I think actually most of the guns in this game that are real guns seem to have their real names actually saying that. Even if it doesn't say, like, Colt M16, it does say M16. Um, but some games don't even call AKs AKs, which is weird. Uh, this guy's flying over again. Hopefully at some point one of the turrets will spot him. I said, they're not as bad as they were earlier in the mission, because they, um... I think there's only one of them flying about now, isn't there, rather than two. Actually, I want to do a little experiment before we end the stream. Um, and do the next bit. So, because I'm near a save point, it doesn't matter. So, um, if I go back into this building, what I want to see is, although I can't hurt that HK myself, I want to see if I shoot at the HK while um, I'm near the plasma turrets, can I lure it into their range and get them to kill it? Because I know those plasma turrets that are up there will kill a HK. And because in theory they're hacked and I own them, if I can get the HK to fly close enough to this area they should pick it up. Right, where is the HK? Is it? Right, it's detected me, good. Right, come here HK. Uh, this is what I want to see now, is if I can get these turrets. Ah, uh, yep, there we go. So now I just need to take cover from the HK. Yes, but I'm really dead right now. Oh. Right, I think in theory this will work. It's just, um... Because you'll probably get loads of resources if that crashes. Oh, so that is actually its real name then. Oh, that's cool. Thanks, Mike. But yeah, good to know that they actually used the real name then. Does it say what calibre it is? I'd assume looking at the size of it, 45 ACP, but punches did say it looks like a 30 cal. Is that like 30, um... Some sort of 30 auto loading calibre. Is there a 30 ACP? I think there's a 32 ACP in there, but never mind. Oh! Died straight away again. say gun but not asbestos oh oh you mean like in the YouTube chat yeah that's weird isn't it especially how anti-gun they are As you know asbestos is responsible for more school shootings apparently than firearms uh, I'm just gonna see if there's a place here I can take proper cover 
Ah, this bit might work better here because it's got more of a roof on to protect me from the rockets. So when I see the HK again... There he is, over there somewhere. Right, now let's run over here so you have to fly over. Thing, I know he can beeline directly over this bit, but what I want to actually see is if that means... Is he lost sight of me? Oh, there he is. Oh good, I heard a turret firing. The other turret's definitely shooting it now. It's just, can both the turrets do enough damage before um, the HK kills them? That's the only thing I'm wondering. I'm not actually saying they are punches, but you know what? You know how these sort of sights work, don't you, with the stuff they say? That's actually going quite well this time. What I basically just want to happen is the HK to keep being distracted HK's by me. Down. There we go. I repeat, HK's down. Don't give us some breathing space. Fuck yeah, we do. So yeah, there, there was actually dialogue for doing that. So that is something that you know they thought you might do. But I suppose it's a bit day of sexy, isn't it? This game like that. And there you go. You get four rockets, forty-seven purple plasma, two explosives. So yeah, you get good shit for uh, looting that. Um, I definitely want to drop something to pick up the purple plasma. Um, probably drop the shotgun shell. No, I'll drop that laser rifle I'm not using. Just because purple uh, violet plasma is the really good one you want near the end of the game. Is there a Terminator still wandering around up there? Because I thought at one point there was one just... Yeah, see, there's one there, but is he... Is he inside, like, a tower bit? Or... It might be one that's just, like, there, but doesn't do much. Right? My dad used to be really into snooker, as in he owned a full-size snooker table in the garage. But then he, uh, my parents wanted to convert it into a bedroom, so he sold the snooker table. But yeah, they're big things, aren't they, snooker table compared to pool tables? Let's go finish this mission off then. I'm at the cemetery. The gate is breached. Approach with caution. Alive, look. I don't actually know if Billards is another name for Snooper, if it's a different thing. I've got another skill point. Right, um. Oh, 
probably do toughness one, and then on the next level I'll do the next hacking bit, because I think if I remember right, the level after this one is mostly a shooty level. Um, you know, like not one where you have an open world map, so I might as well use that one to gain XP to then do the hacking, because toughness is obviously a lot more important on missions where you're just running and gunning. What? Didn't one hit my Sergeant, out. there's no one here. Evans must have seen a Terminator. All right, Rivers. Time to pack up and go. Check if there's anything that we could use. <coughs> Wait. I hear something. It's coming from a coffin. Be careful. Yeah, hang on. I'm crafting some ammo before I open the coffin. Oh, I'm Edgar. Don't shoot. Don't shoot. Sergeant, I found some. Yeah, exactly, Fluzzy. Are you the one that sent us that message? Hence why it's more popular yes. in pubs. Yes, I am. I've been trying to reach you ever since I escaped from the convoy. Rivers, we'll question him later. We need to get him out of there. Yes, sir. Move out. I'm heading your way. All right. Let's move. Stay low. Right, so yeah, we've only got like five minutes left in this stream now, because um, we're right by the end of this first level. Like, first proper level, anyway. Okay, so Fuzzy's answered you there. Snooker and billiards are the same thing, then, apparently. Follow me. We need to get that man to safety. I've set up an evacuation point this way. Terminators, you stay behind. Rivers, on me. Please, God, don't let them die. I don't want to be left alone anymore. Oh. I'll just use my automatic then. Clear the way. So can I use my smart rifle safely from this one? Okay, Rivers. I'll take that man out to safety. If you need some time to look around, then this is it. It's up to you. All right, let's move out. Yeah, I've done all the side objectives, so I'll just do that now. Right, I'll use this as the place to stop the stream, because obviously this is a really easy place to now load up um, for the next time. So I'm pretty sure it'll be a save point right here, yeah, if not like I can load guys. one up five same minutes before. Uniform, same so, um, yeah, we thanks for watching everybody, and I'll probably try and do another stream tomorrow if I've got the energy. To a Terminator factory.